three, two, one. On 19th of December 2022, North Korea successfully launched the first of its kind spy satellite. Well, this news made me wonder, does India have any spy satellite? Well, we do. But before we go more into that, you know the drill. Do like, share and subscribe. First, let's understand what are spy satellites. Spy satellite is a commonly used term for an intelligence satellite. They orbit the earth in order to image its surface and to record radio signals for military and political purposes. They transmit their data to earth where it is interpreted by specialists in secret facilities of any country. These special types of satellites are designed for surveillance and provide information about enemy forces with their capabilities. Spy satellites overcome all the limitations of spy planes. In 1955, the US Air Force ordered the development of these satellites to have continuous surveillance of some areas. Later, under the UN project of satellite Sentinel of 2010, these satellites were deployed around the conflicted areas of Sudan and South Sudan. It was done to enforce human rights by regularly monitoring the atrocities. But what can these spy satellites do? Well, firstly, they can keep tabs on the deployment of military forces. They can play a major role in a country's security. For example, they can issue an attack warning by detecting ballistic missiles. Some powerful spy satellites can also detect nuclear detonation from space. They can also assess the damage caused by the bombs. But what about the Indian spy satellites? Well, India is not behind in this race. We also have our set of spy satellites. Radar Imaging Satellite or RESAT is a series of India's spy satellites built by ISRO. In 2009, India launched its first spy satellite, RESAT-2, in the aftermath of the 2008 Mumbai attacks. It was equipped with a sensor known as Synthetic Aperture Radar that takes radar images. SAR sends out hundreds of radio signals every second towards the subject, well in this case the earth and captures the reflected signals to create a radio image which can then be used by computers to build a real image. India bought this technology from Israel for 110 million US dollars, largely for surveillance purposes. It enhanced ISRO's ability for disaster management applications. Now you must be thinking about what happened to Resat 1. So it got delayed and was launched only in 2012, but Resat 1 is no longer operational. In November 2022, Resat 2 finally landed on Earth after completing its job for over 13 years. In May 2019, ISRO launched another spy satellite that is Resat 2B which can observe the Earth in all the weathers and all the conditions. Till the Resat satellite's launch, India depended on images from a Canadian satellite as existing domestic remote sensing spacecraft cannot take pictures of the Earth during cloud cover. So, I hope you like this information for more such videos keep watching money control